everybody, and welcome back to another vlog that's not done at midnight because it's clearly bright outside, but you can't see because there's no windows near me. Oh! Actually, there's a window right there, but you can't see it because it's kind of like behind and that way. So, nah, nah, you can't see how bright or not bright it is outside. Ha ha. Yeah. So, I figured I gotta do an update. It's a little bit late, I know. It's practically the end of May right now, and who knows when this vlog is going up. But, <sighs> Camp NaNoWriMo, last month, April, just in case this goes out in June, <laughs> two months ago. So I decided to do Camp NaNoWriMo, blah blah blah. Oh my goodness, I can't talk. I decided to do Camp NaNoWriMo in April, and I didn't update you guys on that because it kind of sort of didn't go very well. I got up to, I think it was like 12,000 words or something like that. Uh, I'm not sure. I think I, I've got it right here on the computer, so let's see if this breaks anything. Um, currently, it's at, okay, it's at 20,000, so that's good. That's good. I don't know if that counts what I did after April was over, because I think I did a little bit after that, but... Yeah, that actually didn't work out, so... Mm, I don't know what it was about it, but I like the story idea. But I guess the way that I started it off, I didn't like it, so I was just kind of like muddling through it and just like skipping bits here and there because it's like, I don't like this. I don't like this. There's just something about it. I don't like it. So today I have vowed to write a little bit at work or at home each day because this whole not doing some writing in several days in a row is really getting on my own nerves. And I feel bad when I'm like, oh yeah, you could do it, you could do it, yeah, you just do this. And it's like, I haven't done it. It's one of those moments where you give advice, but you don't actually follow through with it yourself. I've done that a lot. And I'm trying not to do that anymore. So, I'm going to write. I don't know any duration of time, just I'm going to write every day. Even if it's just a sentence. If it's a whole chapter. A whole, like... 30 pages, something I'm going to write. So that is my resolution for the rest of the year and onward. So I'm going to do it. So today, uh, uh, let's step back a little bit. Our uh, general manager went on like one of those GM conventions where all the GMs get together and they do like this and that and chat and stuff. So he came back with a bunch of like goodies and such and Nobody wanted all of these notebooks that came with pens attached to them. I snatched one. So I've actually been using this to do the writing that I did today. And aside from the fact that the pen is blue ink, which I prefer black ink, but you know, whatever. It's actually really good because it's got like the little um, bookmark. So I could just slide it right there and then open it up whenever I need to. It's got this right here, which I don't... I mean, it keeps it closed. That's good. It has this. Let's see if you guys know what this is for. It does this. And I cannot for the life of me. None of, nobody can figure out what it does. It's too um, flimsy to like be a prop. So I don't know what it's for. So if any of you y'all have one of these, let me know if you know what it's for. Is it actually for propping it up or is it for something else? Because I would love to know. I'm actually considering getting another one of these. I have two of these, the one that I'm using right now and then another one because nobody wanted them. So I'm like, okay, I'll, I'll take them all. I even got like one that it's smaller, but all it has is a bunch of sticky notes on it. And that's kind of cool. So I may use that for like editing and stuff. Cause it's also got like the little colored tabs and such. I, should, I wish I'd brought it down here with me so I could just show you. I got like three or four of those. Nobody wanted it. It's crazy. I got a bunch of pens. Look at this. Look at all this. This is the derpiest pen ever. It's cheap and everything, but it writes really well. It's so funny. This one, this one has a USB thumb drive in it. I know, right? That's just crazy cool. So that's cool. The writing is really meh though, so. This one's really fancy. It's a pen, click. It's also got the cool thing so you can use it on your phone and such. And it has a light. I know, 
What more could you possibly want? So yeah, there's <laughs> five billion pins and a clicky pin. I don't know about you guys, but I really like clicky pins and I feel bad whenever somebody's around me and I'm using it because all I'm doing is just constantly clicking it and I feel bad, but it helps me think, which is a really weird thing when you think about it. It's like, how does clicking help you think when you not when you hate every little sound that happens whenever you try to write? That's me. I don't get it either. I think it's one of those things where if I make the noise, it's fine. But if anybody else makes it, I'm not expecting it. Therefore, it's annoying. That's how I think it goes. But I'm not quite sure. Hello, phone. It vibrates now because I updated the email app. It's really annoying. Like, no, stop it. Stop it. So, yeah, that's the uh, update on my writing. I've totally started rewriting <laughs> the Camp NaNoWriMo book because I just didn't like it. There was just... I don't know. I think it was how I started it off. Because with this, I'm starting it off in a whole new section. Like, okay. Here's the Camp NaNoWriMo book. You start off introducing every little thing, and then they go to the planet. With this rewriting, it's you... You're at the planet. Boom. You're there. Boom. Done. Consider everything else small fries and... Nah. Just off the plate. It got eaten or something. I don't know. But yeah. Uh, so, I really like this. I'm probably going to take this everywhere I go. Because it's really handy. And it's not that big. I mean, look at that. And it's, you know... I feel movies. I live movies. I love movies. I max movies. Get it? Yeah, I know. But, I mean, it's from a movie theater general manager convention. Everything that they had has something to do with movies or companies that are involved with movies. And somebody's car alarm's going off! Thank you. So, yeah, that's what I'm working on. Um, I'm also working on reading more. Mostly science fiction and horror because what I'm writing is a combination of the two. So I kind of want to like mesh them together and see how well they can mold. Um, it's been a while since I've read a science fiction book and it's been even longer since I've read a horror book. So I really need to step up my game. I have a bunch of anthologies that I think I will start reading maybe nightly or daily or something like that. I'm not quite sure. And then I'm also reading a... Uh, Stephen R. Lawhead book that's kind of science fiction-y. I think it's more fantasy than anything else, but so long as I read, this is good because it's been forever and it's starting to show in my writing because I'm like, ah, la, 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 la. When before, you know, I was reading left and right, I was like, yeah, just writing like crazy. And now it's just kind of like, ah, I don't know. That's how life goes, though, I suppose. So that's it for me today. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I will try to do more writing vlogs, maybe? I don't know. I don't know how well or often they will occur. I'm trying to do a video a week. I may upload more often than that, depending upon like how much time I have and such. So we'll see. Because vlogs are a little bit more difficult to do than gaming videos, mostly because I have to have a topic and I have to have a topic that'll last more than a minute. Because, <laughs> I mean, if it's going to be a minute long vlog, why? So, yeah, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I will see you all next time. Bye!